We're back. Hi, everybody. Hello. Hi, everybody. Uh, been away for a while. It's winter time here, um, so obviously we have no fresh pods in northern Ohio. Um, an example of be careful what you wish for because you might just get it. Um, Ed Naga Canario was nice enough to send us some fresh pods from Georgia this week. Thanks, Ed. Thank baby. you, Ed. Very Thank nice you, of you. Baby. And you can see it's been a while since we've been on because our little daughter is now big daughter. <laughs> Actually, this is Eliza. This is child number eight. No, it's child number one. Well, yeah, number one, but eighth one you haven't She's seen. 18, She's eighteen, number one. She's eighteen, yeah. But anywho, uh, Ed sent us some seven pod, uh, some yellow XLs. I've never heard of those. Don't know what they are. Um, some yellow boots, a really nice Naga Morch, um, brown boot jalokias, um, oh, a seven pod uh, yellow, and a Mommy. seven pod red. Um, tonight we're going to do one that I've never had. Um, it's probably a really bad idea because I haven't had a pod in three months. But he sent us some uh, seven pod browns. And from what I understand, these are not the same Mommy. thing as a Dougla. Quite as well. Um, probably can't tell on video, I don't have a golf ball here, but this pot is absolutely enormous. Um, I said on Chili Grower I wasn't going to eat the big one, but I changed my mind. I'm going to do it anyway. I know I'm going to pay for it, but what the hell. Um, I am not because I am I feel like a rookie again. again I feel we like Eliza. We haven't eaten a pot in about three months. <laughs> and if this is anything like a Dougla, and I'm assuming it probably is, uh, it's not going to feel good. I'm going to cut it just because I want to look at the insides. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Smell that. No, Why is no, it never that positive? Just smell it. Oh, me smell. My goodness. Can I smell Ooh, that, 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 that smells good. Very good smell. The scent in that thing's uh, pretty wild and crazy. Ugh. I am going to steal just a few of these seeds out of here. A, I don't like eating them. B, I want to grow these next year because I don't have seven pot browns. I'm going to try to leave the placenta in here. Just going to grab a chunk of seeds. I will tell you that uh, I'm probably as nervous as the first time I ever decided to try it super hot. Because I haven't had these in so long and I know my tolerance probably sucks right now. And I know I'm going to pay for this severely. But I'm going to man up and eat the whole thing. can't have chilligrower.com and not man up, can you? These things are actually really, uh, surprisingly, because a lot of these super hots don't have a lot of seeds. These, these babies are pretty loaded with seeds. They remind me of the Jamaican hot chocolate look of them. I'm hoping they're only in heat level of the Jamaican hot chocolate, not of a seven pot dougla. Because if it's a dougla, I'm in trouble. Okay. Anyway, the percent everything's still in there. I just took out the... Uh, seed so you know I'm not cutting out hot stuff or anything. Um, this is uh, fairly thin walled actually. And it smells uh, seven pod, Trinidad, scorpions type smell. Um, nice looking pods though. Very, very big. Like I said, you probably can't tell that from the... There's an iPhone and there's the pod. They're pretty big. Very so anywho, healthy looking. I'm going to eat the biggest one because Ed sent it so this is for you Ed. No. Um, and these two we're going to eat. <laughs> Either smell or eat party, I'll save that big one for later. I'm not going to eat even half of it. No, you don't want no, half of it. Uh, no. Yeah, I'm not going to eat. No, we'll give you a sliver. She's never had a hot pepper in her life, other than a dried, one of our dried pods. Little, little tiny, tiny itty bitty piece. piece. So, Eliza's just getting a very, very, very <laughs> tiny sliver. <laughs> like, yeah, she's gonna get really, really, really tiny. tiny. So you don't even hold it. In fact, I'll give it to you when you're ready. Oh, oh my God! God. Um, how much you want, buddy? Um, my tummy's really big. I know your tummy's really big. There's a lot of seeds. Cut, cut a quarter of that. So you want? You're eating basically a quarter of a pod. Yeah. You want that much? Oh, good. Mm. No. <laughs> Sorry, Ed. Half of that? Yeah. So she's eating a quarter or a half of a quarter, whatever that comes out well, to Well, yeah, in the last two months, though, the hottest pepper I've ate is a jalapeno. Half a quarter, so. an eighth, the eighth. Sorry, brain's not working right. Kevin, you want any? No. <laughs> All right. 
so it's I'm very gonna, good. I'm going to regret this. Man, I sure yes. hope this isn't as hot as a Dougal. Make sure you wash your hands when you're done with that. Yeah. Like really scrub them with Dawn Disco. I did drink some chocolate milk beforehand. Uh, we got from Neil from uh, Hip Sea Company. True mood. It's the drink way it to before, go. Drink it before, drink it after. Glass of Metamucil. Hopefully it keeps doing the trick because this thing's probably going to hurt. Up yours. Pray. <coughs> I wasn't going to wish you guys a good luck. You guys are going to hate it. <coughs> 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 chocolate. Chocolate. Really sweet. Chocolate? He's already kicking. He's like a whole. Ooh. Oh man, I'm a dumbass. <laughs> Spit it out, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that is hot. Oh. Ow. You're a grinning chili girl right now, aren't you? Wow. Ooh. A little bit bitter. You're taking that like a man. Ow. Ooh, don't wait three months in between eating peppers. No, don't. Don't. Oh my god. It has a very bitter taste. Oh, shit. My tongue hurts. Happens. You want, you want to give her a piece of bread? <laughs> Um, hey, Mommy, remember um, Austin's tongue was real good and he was... I don't really care for that pot, actually. I don't like it either. Mama. Started out real uh, sweet. Mommy. Whoo, damn. Mommy. Mom, remember... Um, it got uh, real bitter real quick. Mommy, remember Austin's tongue was... Right now that heat's really focused on my tongue. Hope that goes away. Mommy. That hurts really bad. Whew, Mommy. that's hot. Mommy. Mommy. <clears throat> Try the whole one. Oh, no. He's going to be hurting. He is. Mommy. You got some tears going right now. Hey, Mommy. <coughs> do you remember Austin? Tell right where I kept chewing at it, that's where it's like. Mommy. Mommy. It's about quiet. <coughs> uh, leaving the tongue now, starting to get the throat. Hey, Kevin, give me that sign. Mommy. Mommy. I'd oh. say thanks, Ed. But, uh. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that. Mm -hmm. uh, tissue, just a second. That little okay. tiny piece I ate, my stomach's already bubbling. Mm -hmm. But at the McDermott household, there is mm -hmm. no whining. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, I actually got a buzz off that one. Whew. My girl also's tongue was burning and he was crying about it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Heat's not really building anymore right now, but it's uh. It's not going anywhere. Pretty intense in the back of the throat, back of the tongue. My tongue is burning. Uh, uh, you could do just like one of them said, just let the saliva run down your tongue. I'm trying. I don't know if that's as hot as a zuba, <laughs> but it's pretty damn hot. Definitely don't like the taste as well as the Dougal. No. Oh yeah, I got buzz off that. I am about that close to drinking milk though, but I'm not going to. I did. Mommy. So my tolerance right now is uh, drastically Mommy. reduced. I haven't eaten a pepper in about three months. Ask Kevin. Probably wasn't the best pepper to start Kevin. back off with. What do I need to ask? Mommy? I'm trying to think of what the first initial I'm taste gonna, was. The, um, the first initial taste you can, can tell there's going to be a, a powy, a heat. But do you want some? I actually like the initial go. taste. It was real. Uh, okay. <clears throat> to me, all sweet. I could, well, I, I couldn't taste sweet. I could taste just a fresh, a fresh taste. But <laughs> they got. Uh, <laughs> they got real bitter real quick. Yeah. Which I've never had out of a seven pot or a Trinidad Scorpion. Baby's got some staying power. Starting to feel in the chest a little bit. <laughs> I, it's starting to subside for me. What about you? Carry each other half. Well, yeah. heck no. Is the, the heat going dying? No. 
Remember when I ate my first pepper? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I like how uh, he's a little uh, Remember Austin's tongue is burning and he's crying about so it? He's not really building oh. anymore, but... Uh, okay, that was wet. <laughs> he's not really going away yet either. Hey, baby. I'm kind of focused about the middle of the tongue now. I'm really starting to feel <clears throat> down here. Are you getting any other aftertaste other than just that bitter? No, nah, taste pretty much gone. It's got a lot of heat. We did eat uh, not a whole lot before this, but we ate. Hopefully, I don't pull Drew. Please. Uh, Might make you feel better, though. For sure. Uh, well, it's definitely not it's definitely a got Jamaican it. hot chocolate. <laughs> no, that heat's, uh, that's heat sticking around. I'm trying to think of what type of any sort of food or anything that that pepper would go with. None. Uh, it's not one of my favorites. For sure. Definitely up there in heat. Of course, I can't really say because, like I said, I was... We were eating super, super ice almost daily. Uh, it's been a while. <clears throat> um, if I would have had this back then, I could have made a better judgment, I guess. But as of right now, with low tolerance, it's definitely uh, not the hottest I've had, but it's uh, it's up there. <clears throat> definitely nowhere near a Duga, I don't think, um, or that cross we had, or the Butch Tea, or the Brain Strain. But uh, or the primo, they but, all uh, have better, way better taste. Yeah, like I said, usually the uh, Trinidad Scorpion chocolate I didn't care for too much, and that really wasn't that hot. But other than that, I'm a big fan of Seven Pies and Trinidad. But uh, I didn't like that pie too much. Very bitter. Whew. Heat's finally starting to go away. A little bit of tongue burn Does yet. Belly hurt yet? Yeah, really bad. But uh, Ed. Uh, Thanks for the pot. I think that uh, Naga Morich might have to get eaten here in the next couple of days. That's a uh, really nice looking Naga. Naga. Almost looks like that, uh, <laughs> if I remember correctly, it was a long time ago, but it kind of looks like that uh, Savannah 7 you had sent, which is a really hot and good pod. But uh, that should be a good pod there. The, uh, excuse me, Boot, uh, boot the okay Chocolate. Wow, I do appreciate you sending them. Probably won't eat that one for a while because we grew like five billion of those things this year. Uh, <coughs> sorry. By the way, that pot did not give me the hiccups. Um, Bujalokia. Yellows are really good. They're one of my, one of our favorite pots. Yeah. They have a really good taste. So I like those. That's... We didn't get a lot of those when we had one planet. We started it late. Those are awesome. So, uh, interested in this one too. Like I said, that seven pod, uh, Yellow 7 Pot XL, I'm not sure what that is. So if anybody knows, PM me or something. I'll have to do a little research on that. I've never heard of that. It's a funky looking pod. It really doesn't look like a 7 Pot that I've seen, but uh, smooth. Um, so, looks cool though. So, we got some goodies deep for the next couple of weeks. See what this one does to me though. But, uh, pretty good now. Starting to feel some heat in the belly, so I'm sure I'm going to be kicking my ass here in the next couple of hours. But, and then I'll uh, get to say, I told you so. Got a man up, man. Couldn't eat half pods. That'd be a waste of time. Really short. <laughs> so, but anywho, uh, thanks for watching. Hope the video didn't bore you too much. First one we've done in a while. But uh, yeah. uh, if you like heat, that's definitely a good pod. Um, if you don't care about the flavor, if you don't give a crap about flavor. Uh, it's not that good of a pod. At least that one wasn't. Um, but definitely a lot of seeds. So we'll be growing these next year. I'm sure some people out there love them. So. Just my personal preference, I didn't care for them. So anywho, thanks for watching. Check out chiligrower.com. Thanks. Bye guys.